Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Nerds of Ren YouTube channel. We are working towards 250 subscribers, so if you love Star Wars, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell so you never miss an upload. And I hope you enjoy today's video. The Mandalorian Season 3 finale is out, and we have so much to talk about. Personally, I really enjoyed this episode. I loved the way that Bo was leading the Mandalorians in battle versus Moff Gideon's troopers. I think she showed up and led as a true Mandalorian leader should. She stepped up to the plate and gave us some awesome scenes. She knew Gideon would be tough to beat, but went anyway. Gideon was absolutely incredible. Seeing him in the full Beskar suit with his staff was awesome. I got heavy Darth Maul vibes. I'm definitely going to be making videos on my theories on the connection between the two or why I think Gideon takes inspiration from Maul. We finally get to see what Gideon was using Grogu's blood for. Personally, I loved it. Obviously, I was like everyone else in believing that he was creating Snoke or Palpatine clones. However, he was just cloning himself, trying to make the most pure and perfect versions of himself. I actually love that storyline. The growth that we have seen from Grogu has been wonderful. He was a true hero in the episode. Without Grogu, we would have lost Din and Bo-Katan. We have finally gotten to see some of what he's learned from Luke. It was nice to see the tie-in between the episode from the Book of Boba Fett when he trained with Luke. I have plenty of videos about theories as to what's next for Grogu, so stay tuned to the channel. Din Djarin had an amazing story in this episode. I truly felt like this episode was more about him and Grogu growing together and truly trusting each other. Din was ready to give his life to save Grogu and it showed how much he truly cared for the little green guy. The fight between him and Gideon was one of my favorite moments of the show. However, when it switched from him to Bo, I felt like we finally got to feel the tension between Bo and Gideon. We heard the story and knew what happened, but now we got to know how it felt for Bo when she was in combat with Gideon. I think without the suit, she destroys him, but that's a different topic for a different day. The Praetorian Guards versus Grogu and Den was an amazing fight scene. They were not holding back and truly trying to kill the child, but seeing his pure ability from his training show through the fight was magical. It really blended well with what we've seen. I feel like we are not done with his Force slash Jedi training just yet. I think there's definitely more to come. Formerly Grogu, now Den Grogu. I feel like this has been coming for three years and I couldn't be more happy about it. We got to see Grogu become a Mandalorian and then we see the Mythosaur. I think they were teasing for what's to come in the future with Grogu possibly using beast control, similar to the way Anakin did in Attack of the Clones, to tame and ride the Mythosaur. All in all, I thought this was a phenomenal finale to Season 3. I want to know what you guys thought of the episode and the season as a whole, so leave a comment and let's chat. Like the video for more awesome Star Wars content, and subscribe to the channel, and join the family. I hope you've had an awesome day, and I will see you in the next one.